Hey there rock stars, your Guitar Sage, and today we're going to learn how to play Times Like These by the Foo Fighters. I'm looking at my chart here on my screen, and for those of you that can get this right away, then uh, check it out and we'll learn it pretty quickly. For those of you that need more help, stick around and we'll try to use the whole 10 or 11 minutes that you two allots us and we'll learn this tune, okay? So the song's based in the key of D. Um, again, I'm looking at my chart here. I've got one of my students came to me the other day with this tune, and I, I love the Foo Fighters. So um, I'm going to teach it to you today. We're in the basic key of D. We don't need a capo, and um, the timing is four. So four, four, or what we call four. So like one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So here we go. From the top, it's going to go. So it's going to go intro, right? Verse, chorus, turn around. Verse, chorus, bridge, turn around, out. Okay, so up to now we've done intro, verse, chorus, turn around. And then we would have been going into the next verse, chorus, uh, which are going to be the same. Okay, so verse and chorus are the same. Um, if you're having a hard time writing these chords down and what have you, um, go to yourguitarstage.com. You can find out how to get a chart to this uh, song. The same handwritten charts that I write for my students here, um, you can get a hold of and it will make things a lot easier than you having to write this stuff down all the time too. Plus I've got a great instructional booklet there, an ebook, an electronic book. Um, it's only 10 bucks. Deal, right? Total deal. So go get that and it'll help, help you a ton, okay? Um, you can learn more about that on the site. Okay, on with the song. So the next section we're getting into is the bridge, okay? And um, the bridge is, I'll name the chords out for you, and these are going to be pushed. Um, the first chord is not. What we mean by push is you anticipate the chord. You play it earlier than the actual downbeat, okay? So for instance, um, the chords for the bridge are D, C, but you push it before the one. So instead of one, two, three, four, instead of doing that, you push it. So one, two, three, four, push. Okay. So the chords are D. Sorry, from the top, top of the bridge. D, C. E minor 7 slash B, D, C, E minor 7 slash B, then, then we're back to the top again, okay? Um, the outro of the song is the chorus again, okay? So <clears throat> let's talk about the particulars now. Um, Oh, and also the song ends on a C9. But let's talk about the particulars. Okay, first off, um, the intro, or really any place you hear that main riff, anytime you hear that, this is what we're doing. Holding the D down, and we're lifting the second finger up. Okay, so basically it's, a, it's what we call a suspended chord, a 2-3 suspension. Uh, most people are used to playing a suspension like this. But this is called a 2-3 suspension, it's the other way around. Usually it's 4-3, but this is 2-3. We're naming the notes 
of the scale, uh, D scale, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. So that's um, one, two, three, four, four, three, or two, three. I know, confusing, right? Um, so forget about it, just play this right here. Here's a D, and here's a D suspended. A two, a two, three suspension. Also known as a nine chord, if you want to get technical. Um, so you're just going to go back and forth between the, the D nine, or the D suspended, and the uh, D chord, like this. And you're going to go... Okay, every single time, strumming wise, same thing. Get it? Okay. So um, here, um, okay, that's 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 it. Verse is gonna go like this. It's gonna go D for a measure, A minor seven for a measure. Now some some people play their A minor like this, and you could play that. Um, but the way Mr. Grohl plays it is he puts his pinky right here. Okay, so anyhow, little Hendrix thing here for you. Um, put your pinky right here. Okay, that's the, or sorry, those are both sevenths right there, so, or flat sevens, if you will. So, first measure is a D, second measure is A minor seven, put your pinky up there, then a split bar of C, E minor. Split bar is where we have two beats per chord, so C, E minor, and then back to that. a whole measure. And then we're back to D again. A minor 7, C, E minor, and then two measures of, okay, chorus is going to go C, E minor, the split bar, so two, two beats a piece, C, E minor, D for two beats, C for two beats, Back to the um, the turnaround again. Okay, turnaround is typically the intro reinstated. Okay, some of you may say, "Well, this song's in four. Why are they doing one measure of D?" Darn good question. Um, because Mr. Grohl decided to go into a measure of two. So song's in four four, but he does a measure of two for those D's during the chorus. Pretty clever stuff. Beatles did that a lot. Um, sixes and fives and sevens and elevens and all sorts of weird stuff. So, okay, so um, so we got intro, verse, chorus. Everything else, kids, is the same. Um, intros, verses, and chorus are all the same. Bridge again is going to go D, C, E minor seven slash B. And what that is, is here's your E minor, you're used to that, here's an E minor 7, so lift your ring finger, take your thumb and mute this string, I don't want to hear it, it doesn't belong, okay, because we want to be in the bass, right, here's an E minor 7, we be in the bass, we don't want that, we want to be in the bass, B, 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 there it is, I don't know what I was singing, so that's the chord we want, um, E minor 7 slash B, um, then it goes D again, C, E minor 7 slash B. Okay. Um, strumming wise. You've got this first part down, right? It's really down, up, down, up, down, up all the time, except for there's, there's one in there that uh, is two ups, and, and I'll do it slowly here for you. I'm not doing this bit down here. Down, up, down, up, down. Down, up, up, down. Down, up, down. Write it down, good. Here we go, verse is gonna go. Here we're gonna go. Down, 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 up, up, down, down, down. That's pretty much it. 
much going to be the same for the A minor 7 and the rest of it. And here, this is going to be... Here, for the, C, e, for the C, E minor part, I want you to go... Down, 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 up. And then for the D again, we got... Okay, guys. Man, we're running out of time. We got to go. Sorry, that's it for today. Keep watching the video over and over again. Go to yourguitarsage.com, get the ebook, and uh, hit subscribe if you haven't already here on YouTube. Later. See ya.